what were my expectations of the break? I actually didn't have a whole bunch of expectations. I like to go in with these things open-minded, but I expected to learn more about business, learn more about how to grow my business and how to, and, and learn more from other, from other women who were, who were in a similar situation to me. So the experience has been fantastic so far. So I've got about less than a week to go and I don't want to leave. I am not used to being surrounded solely by women and living together in one place and you hanging out together. Like I must admit in the first week I was a little bit, I don't know what the word is. I was, I, I was uncomfortable because I wasn't used to it and getting to know people and getting to know where they're from and where they come from and their businesses, it's been, fantastic and something shifted for me after the first week and I really embraced the whole experience I, I, I feel like I'm in touch more with my emotions I feel like I'm better in my business I feel like I'm where I'm supposed to be instead of constantly thinking that I should be further I should be doing this and I feel more comfortable in my own skin as well a lot of the entrepreneurial world is full of men and full of men doing it in a man's way and being surrounded by so many women has made me feel really comfortable in doing it our way, in, in being in tune to business as a woman. And I, I, yeah, I, I've just been blown away by the experiences. The mentorship sessions have been great. The whole community here has been amazing. I mean, look at this place. The, 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 the location has been fantastic. But the women pulling together and and teaching each other like we've all been doing skill shares so there's been official skill shares but we've actually done unofficial ones as well because people want to give they want to give their knowledge and yeah I, I, I'll probably get emotional I, I will get emotional on the day that we leave because it's been fantastic it's been personal growth professional growth it's been a break as well of, of not having to be on all the time and being part of this community of these women and this and a larger break community has been yeah invaluable so our host company Provost Remotos have been fantastic Lara has been our mama throughout this whole thing she's been there looking after us not just looking after us but she's been involved in every little piece that we've been doing she's been she took us to her local village we met some of these wonderful women who made us this amazing dinner and we'd like we would laugh with them we joke we shared stories we don't speak the same language but it didn't feel like there was that barrier there and actually getting to see places that are not the typical tourist traps seeing parts of regional Spain, regional Gran Canaria, where we get to see local businesses, entrepreneurs, and see how they live their lives. And, and the schools that we went to as well, where we, we listened to young people from Gran Canaria. And what do, they, what do they want? What are their hopes and dreams? And do they think that's possible to have that in Gran Canaria? Do they feel like they have to leave? And we really just, we got immersed in, in this whole life here. And this is now my second home. <laughs> Break in one word. <laughs> growth, personal and professional, I'm adding those two on. <laughs>